Hoo-ha! Hi! Welcome! Welcome to OneSculpt! My name is Jacob and today we'll be looking how to create an insert mesh brush. Let's jump right in ZBrush and see wh what can we do. So we are here in ZBrush and I have created this um, little face. And this little face has uh, many subtools here. And perhaps when you're creating uh, a face again and again and again, uh, perhaps I don't want to create any part of it again and again. So I can create an insert mesh brush for this uh, to make me a life a bit easier. How to do that? Firstly, we will select, for example, I want to create these eyelids here. So let's change to polygroups. And I want to create an insert mesh brush of these eyelids. How to do that? We simply press B and we have here an option, create insert mesh. This will create a brush. So when I press on create insert mesh, uh, Zebra asked me to append auto or to create a new and I want of course to create a new insert mesh brush and here on this side there is the in insert mesh brush so when I, the insert mesh brush is here in, uh, in the brush menu and for example I will deselect these uh, Eye parts, select the face, because the face have here subdivision levels, I will freeze them. Then I will zoom out. Then I have this insert mesh brush selected. Then I can simply drag this out. The face will be have been masked and I can simply, oh, beware, uh, that it will um, simply melt together. I mean, okay, it's need a bit more refinement, but we have created a insert mesh brush and I can do this for every part of my character or my face, I can create this for the whole face when I want it. So guys, I hope that you find that video helpful. When it is so, then please like and share this video. If you like what I'm doing, then please uh, subscribe to my channel or follow me on my social media. That will be nice. When I didn't mention something you want to know, Write me a comment and I will make a video about that. Thanks for your time, guys. Thanks for watching. The links to my social media are listed down below, as you see right now. Thanks for watching and we see us the next time.